of Saturday, and we're looking at a 1977 Pontiac Firebird Trans Am. It is a badge that we could unlock, and I don't understand why you haven't unlocked it. Stop, stop, no one's driving. All right, let's check out your gears right here. There's your gear shift. Look at that old radio. Oh my goodness, doesn't even have a cassette. Does it have an eight track? No, no, no. 1977, you know that's real. All right, so this is a very classic, of course. It's the Smokey and the Bandit. The Bandit's black Trans Am. We decided just to go straight black rather than the full bird on the hood. But um, we'd like to see him get a gold medal today so we can unlock that badge. And I don't understand why we haven't been able to unlock that badge yet. Because all he needs is a gold medal. He's been on the podium 17 times in his career. Um, he's working toward Dr. Trans Am. But let's go ahead and check him. He's a vintage what? He's a vintage American motorsport. And we need to get a silver and a bronze. Actually, we need to... Okay, so he could go to Bathurst, which would be tough. Could go to Sebring, which wouldn't be bad. Go to Alps Festival. Go to Le Mans. He set it off to Sebring. He's staying in the United States. Sebring International Raceway. Sebring International is a great track. Now we have some badges we'd like to unlock today. This will be a badge Saturday. First one we saw, and I don't understand why it hasn't been unlocked yet, is earn a gold medal with a Firebird Trans Am 1977. We. I don't understand it. We should have already unlocked that. But uh, we'll give him a shot here today to get his 18th podium, which is a gold medal. Um, amazing we haven't unlocked that yet, apparently. Uh, 7.45 a.m., of course. Beautiful morning at 70 degrees in Sebring International. It's Florida. It's two laps. It's 3.7 miles. Let's look at the starting grid. Here on a bad Saturday. Or is a bad Saturday. It's Defox. Oh my goodness, and a Plymouth Cuda. We're running in the Trans Am 77. There are a couple others out there. Maybe we have to get the Trans Am 73 and the Trans Am 69 to make it real. Um, Dolestat, HRT Plasmatic in a Mustang. Dolestat in a ZR1. Stewie Lar in a Ford Mustang. Gracie Parra in a 69 Mustang. And Lancer RE5 has a Chevy Camaro 1970. Remember, one, two, three is gold. We need a gold medal. Maybe we need one from every Trans Am. So this might be a Trans Am Saturday when it comes right down to it because we want to unlock that badge. Straight black, no fr no uh, frills at all. Wouldn't be too crazy. Looking good though here. Boy, who is that? That's Halo 343. Around here. Here right now, remember there are only two laps, so you can't get far behind. Good vision through the windows here. No 77 Firebird. Pontiac, of course, out of production as a vehicle. Oh, I see the Cuda. CM Martins. We passed there today. Oh boy, I think that Cuda might tumble. See ya. Whoa, just took out the 100 and just got wide. behind us. Like I said before, the 77 Trans Am here has gotten 17 podiums, so I have no clue how we haven't unlocked the gold medal. It's a one, I believe, seven times. Great. So, uh, maybe today's the day. 
then again, I have level 25 affinity with the with the Mercedes. Um, I'm sorry, with the um, Ferrari, and I haven't unlocked that yet. Either. All right. So five minutes into the Twitch TV broadcast, we're here in American Motorsport Vintage lead, trying to get a gold medal. The 1977 Firebird got a black one. Away from now 15th up to 8th. Right behind Dolestot, which is a good place to be because you know he's tough. I'm going to cut this corner, trying to make it a little better. Here in real racing, that is extremely illegal, but we just got ourselves really close to a podium by doing it. Is that Kayla the Awesome? It is. HRT Plasmatic right behind us. That first lap inside the vehicle. I say the vision in this vehicle is huge. He might get a fancy one if he does well, but uh, before he becomes Dr. Dr. Trans Am. But, uh, oh boy, I know it. There's the hood. Lap number two begins. Get through. Maybe a red one. Stay close, I know we can get up there. The key tops, I do believe. Can we move the yes. Okay, rolling good right now in Sebring. Might seem like, oh well, there's no way we're gonna get a goal, believe me. There's no way I'm gonna win, I know that. I don't think I would definitely win this. But, uh, behind four and three. Dude, get out of my way. I'm in the Firebird today. Sorry, Mustang, but I'm gonna leave you behind. Competitors today. It's gonna be pretty close for goal, but I think we got him. Oh yeah, we got him. We got him right here. Goodbye. Third. I don't think we'll get much better than third, but third is gold, and that's what matters the most. We don't get caught on Sunset Bend. Alright, looking good. As you should, there's the Pontiac Firebird. Trans Let's hope we get a badge unlocked. Let's hope we get a badge unlocked. We're back in the vehicle. What picture is that? Eighteen photo. Not really close. Gold medal and what are you gonna give us? This is our eighteenth podium now. Come on. Seriously, nothing, right? Seriously? <laughs> you know what? All right. Seriously, not going to give it up.
Seriously not going to give it up. Hmm. You can drive it to our reward available, but uh, couldn't unlock the badge. I mean, we'll we'll look at it right now. Maybe I'm blind or dumb or something. As I'm looking at this badge, I'm looking at Iconic Infinity. And I'm looking right over here. Where is it? Win a gold medal in a 1977 Firebird Trans Am. What did I just do? I won a gold medal in a 1977 Firebird Trans Am, unless I'm just, unless I'm just crazy, okay? I just won a gold medal in a Firebird Trans Am, 1977. And you can see, I've won 18 of them. <laughs> Apparently that's not good enough. I'm sorry, I've won 13 of them in 18 races with seven. Eh, oh well, okay, no big deal. So now, we were going for, um, Audi um, badge today, but that would be iconic. So what we're going to try to do is look for, I mean, that would be a, um, affinity level. We could have an Alfa Romeo Saturday. So if we went for uh, Audi, see, we'd have to get level 25. So let's go to the iconic infinity. I want to try to unlock something today that has not been unlocked before and there's the firebird one i don't drive 500 eh, i don't know about that one um one okay uh-huh nsx uh-huh m5 i could do that one for sure more than one miata more than one acura integra more than one impreza more than one focus i can definitely do that Corvette, I did that one already. Yeah. More than one Civic, I got that as well. Hmm. Let's go ahead and try to. I... Okay. Let's check this out. Bye. More than one Focus, huh? Let's see. I didn't buy it in two years. Let's see. More than one focus. Now let's check it out. Okay. There's a Mustang. There's a Fiesta. There's a Focus ST. I don't own him yet. Apparently I don't. Yep. Alright. That's the one. Let's see his designs. This should unlock a badge. I've seen that one before. That Hyatt. Black and teen. Mm -hmm. Airwaves? Not bad. Still bark. Not bad either. Okay, which one? Randy Jobes. Still bark? Or airwaves? All right, airwaves it is. It's only 35000 That's not a big purchase. We're buying it with tokens. We should unlock. Yes! New badge and title unlocked. New badge and title unlocked. Focus Collector has been achieved. Nice. This is your 2013 Ford Focus ST. Let's give him a chance. He looks good. Okay. Unlocking badges on Badge Saturday. What league would he be in? He's a compact. He's a comp. Ooh, he's a hot hatch. He's a hot hatch, just like the Happy Holidays Ford Focus. Wow, almost his upgrade is almost as much as his uh, price. Ha! All right, it's all good. Shouldn't have to upgrade him again, that's for sure. All right. Um, Divisional gold is already here. So where do we want to send him? Maybe to Audi. 
Want to send him to Prague full reverse? Mm -hmm. we return Sounds to good Prague, to me. All right. Famous for its imposing and magnificent Prague full R. That means we're going the opposite way. That means we'll see things before we usually do. We'll be going the reverse way through the Charles Bridge. We'll be going the reverse way through the Archway Colonnade. We'll be going the reverse way through Old Town Prague. As a matter of fact, that's where we'll start and drive through it. Crossing the Vltava River in reverse. Oh, not really going on the river. But hopefully we don't go in the river. It's 9 a.m. 57 degrees Fahrenheit. 19 corners in a reverse circuit, which is very cool. Everything's the same, except you're going in the opposite direction, which means instead of ending at Yonhus, you begin at Yonhus. Let's check it out. Wow, a 2013 Focus. Very nice. Rudy Purr. Rudy Purr is in the Mini Cooper. 2009, that could be a Peppa Pig. We don't know. Or something. Maximus 2 is here. DD1454 is here. Stewie Lar came back. Good to see you again, Stewie Lar. Pro ZZZZ. And Smoking Tiger 264 in Hondas and Coopers and Civics and Peugeots and A Bars and many others. Remember. What did it help us? I see something. Airwaves focus. Looks good. Got the Patronus on the front. The airwaves focus. We're ready to roll in lap one of two. That sun shining in the face. There's Bros. Easy Z and his happy holiday home done. Stewie Lar in that red mini. Oh boy, this focus is nice. Look at him roll. Just went by Jan Hoos. Coming up on Ricaro and Bella Bella. A debut gold. It's my little pony golden edition. Bumped you a little bit. Ah, broken, broken driver's side window. Okay then. Extremely well right now. Oh, there's Saint Vitus in reverse. My goodness, you see it so well from this angle. Archway Colonnade. We're moving through. I see six, five, four, and three. As a matter of fact, this focus might be even better than the Happy Holidays focus. My goodness. So the Airwaves Ford focus is really doing it. Man, all the way up to three, right behind the Red Bull and Peppa Pig. Come on, get them! Okay, they're saying bye to some background. Oh wow, coming around that the back way. They're saying bye to some Peppa Pig. Coming up to the main town square. Astronomical block. And on the right, it's Jan Hoos. Airwaves hood. Check out the street. Pretty cool. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Relax. 
There's St. Vitus. And the Vatava. Old Vatava grid. 3 2 1 grid. What'd you do? Voodoo Purr. Stewie Lara moved up to third. DD 1454. He's trying to get a podium. Pro Z Z Z Z. And Coffee Sky. Smoking Tiger's back there as well. There is St. Vitus, right to our left. We speed through the streets of the world. Oh well, heading through the archway. In reverse, with the street view. Alright, let's check out this airwaves. Ah, we get to see the back side of the buildings that we go by every time. In Frog Pool. Airwaves, you're moving great, man. You don't have anything to worry about. Going reverse through the Garden District. fans are seeing. Oh, look at those people on the back side of that. Never get to see that, ever. Back side of the houses as you travel through. Wow, look at that car behind me. Who is that, I wonder? Check it out here. But this Ford Focus is a really nice vehicle. My goodness, got a little bit of a bang there. Actually, he is catching up slightly. Whoever that driver might be. Is that Stewie Lar? Is that Stewie Lar behind us? Check that grid, 3, 2, 1. Sure is, and Pro CCC is up past the pole, third. So all three friends have a podium spot. Question is, will airwaves hold on? Oh my goodness. In the rear view, I think we can hold it. There he is, Stewie Law right behind, and St. Vitus in the background, and debut victory for the Ford Focus. Whoo, that was close. Look at Stewie <laughs> in his red Mini Cooper. So, great job there. Patronus Motor Base. Brand new purchase. Brand new badge. Debut victory. Victory Ford! Tremendous work there by the Ford Focus. Getting us up to 382 driver level. We've already got iconic infinity or iconic affinity with the Ford. So. We don't even have to think about that. Great job. Now we're going to go try to earn another badge. It's a Forza badge Saturday. As you saw, we were unfortunately unable to unlock the Carpentaro available. Um, we were unable to unlock the Firebird one. It's kind of upsetting. Um, all right. So let's see. Let's go to Iconic. And we see a brand new focus badge. Pretty cool. We own more than one. Own more than one Firebird. He might give us that. Let's do it. Okay, we've already got one with plenty of gold medals, and they won't give us that gold medal. Maybe we need more than one. Who knows? Um, let's go in there and buy a Firebird. Mm. Day. Pontiac's out of production, but we're going to purchase one today anyway. It is 2013, y'all. So, Big P. It's a great job, Ford Focus. P? So which Pontiac Firebird should we purchase? Uh, ooh, that one's real, but it's a DLC. Yeah, we can go with the 73 or the 69. Which one's cheaper? 73. I like the 69. Oh boy. It'd be cheaper to get this one. But I like this one. 
The Radical Steel DLC. Let's go with the 69 truck. Trans Am. All right. So this should unlock Affinity. Iconic Affinity badge for this buddy. And I'm going to have to get the other one too. They'll, maybe they'll just give it to us when we get every Trans Am. And uh, Merry Christmas, Firebird. Ooh, the green 66. That's also cool. The green 69 would be better since it's a 60. Ooh. Good. Ooh, this, is that Sebring Goodyear? And the green 3. Alright. Randy Toe. Which one we like? We got the green 3. We got the Sebring 23. We got, look. Look, look, we got the green 66, and we got the Merry Christmas. No? Want the... Go with the 23? Okay, okay. We'll go with the 23. Kind of like that. Ooh, that's a cool one, man. So Yod Engineering. Let's buy him. Yeah, he's pretty cool. I'll buy him with tokens. Yes! New badge and title has been unlocked! Firebird Collector has been unlocked! This is your 1969 Our second Pontiac badge Firebird on uh, Forza Badge Saturday. We're going to give him a run. He should be in some kind of American muscle something. Let's see. He's vintage for sure. Oh, he's back in American motorsport, huh? Alright. All cool. Now we got the Boss, the Skynet T2, and we got the Trans Am Firebird. We may give you a, a bird on the hood eventually, um, but we're going to try this guy. Firebird, the White 23. How much? Dang. Whatever. They're only credits. Oh, another 23,000. Another 23,000 in credits. About half of it. A little bit more than half of his worth. Uh, let's see. we got to get some blues here, huh? Spa. Catalonia. Alps. Or uh, turn the silver into gold. We Bang, we're going to Bathurst. The Bathurst 1000. The Mount Panorama Circuit in Australia. Trying to turn silver into... Gold with the 69 Firebird. So there's Cochara Hill. There's the Firestone 2 and through. Heading down Cochara Hill and Grand Folk and Gaia Corner. Here to Legendary Bathurst, Australia. We're looking at Super Cheap Auto Hill and we're looking at turning silver into gold at 8 a.m in 62 degrees Fahrenheit on 23 corners. It is Bathurst, Maine. It is Mount Panorama Circuit. It is starting somewhere in the middle of the field. I know that. Two laps, starting eight. Fat Medusa, 280771. My goodness, in a Ford Mustang, Fat Medusa has the pole. Our friends, the professor, Professor Cush, in a Trans Am, 73 Trans Am. MK breakout in a CUDA. DD 1454 in a ZR1. And Mersinho BR in a Dodge Challenger. Beholders back there in a 73 Trans Am as well. My goodness, this could be good. Remember, debut race. Okay, that means one, two, three is gold. <laughs> All right. The white 23. Wow, look at that inside. That's vintage, ancient, 1969. Got a wooden steering wheel. Man. Look at that Trans Am, it's pretty cool actually. Look at that American Motors doing its thing. And, yep, Beholder right behind me. And TD right to the inside. Look out, TD, look out. Coming to and through the fetters. 
MK breakout, he's got a big MK on the back of his vehicle. Is that his CUDA? Look at that MK on the back. You know MK breakout stuff. Guys, check out the vehicle he has there. You gotta check out what that is. What is that MK's? Yeah, M MK's got a CUDA, man. CUDAs are big beasts. Here's Marcinho and his Challenger. Also a cool Dang it! Whoa, Firebird, look at you! Look at you, White 23! Dang. Jason the Puppet. Off the Bob Hill. Bumped him. Didn't hurt him. I know he lost part of his am on his trans. Bang it! Oh lord, that hurt. They're catching up now. Try to hold spammer. Oh boy, not holding well, not holding well. Oh jeez. IDR8 innovation. Bang. Oh boy. It's a good banger, but it's not, his handling is not the best. Looks like it's gonna be tough to get gold. Oh, nice job. Going around Falcon. Oh, a beautiful Falcon tire corner. Alright. That that Plymouth Cuda. See it, Martin. Audi. R8 innovation. Fujitsu. So look at MK! Oh wow, MK, you can try to steal it from here. Looks like... Looks like that red Trans Am is long gone. Nah, not long gone, just made the corner. Up to whole third. I think we're gonna have to pass this one in front of us to get third. I think MK's gonna catch us, or somebody's gonna catch us. I don't know who. What happened to MK? There goes Marcinio into third. I have no idea where MK breakout went. Oh, I wonder. He's right next to me. That's why. They have to just fall off the grid like that. Oh, yeah, it's gonna be really tough to get third today. We'll try though. Looks like we're gonna have to beat Marcinio. Lost that one that is up there in second now. 3 2 1 grid. That's Fat Medusa the pole. I mean, there's a shot. I don't know how much of a shot, but there is a shot. Two and through the fetters. We have enough forts at um, Bathurst to break your mind. And we'll have to get that other barber to do it. Gone. It's Fat Medusa. Oh, good move around Fat Medusa. Jeez. That's nice. Get outside this vehicle now. Heading up. Oh boy, look at that big vehicle, man. That is a big bird right there. Alright, I don't know if we can catch Mercenio, but we're gonna try. Catch him at all. It's gonna be in the in the S's, heading down the hill where he hits the wall and we don't, and we don't. Where he hits the wall and we pass him. Actually, who's that? Hit anything, please. Back, back, fast. Catch him on that last corner. That's MK. Oh boy, Mercino did spin out. And that helps. It's helping off. That's the question. Helps enough if I get this. Alright, this is gonna be a good one. This is gonna be a good finish. Get good drafting, get good drafting. Howdy, all right. Innovation. Who's behind? It's DD. Dee. DD's right behind. Marcinho's right in front. MK's not too far away. There are only two spots and four vehicles trying to get it. A perfect draft. Oh boy, 
it doesn't help us. Definitely didn't help me. Yeah, Virginia's gonna get it. Unless we can get him in this last bit, get back inside the vehicle. Can we get him in this last corner? I don't think so. We're gonna try though. Cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it inside. Debut silver. And held the silver. I think we got a fourth in the last race, too. Ah, that's tough. At least we got Firebird Collector. Good try. Good try, buddy. You were there. Got a little loose in that first lap. You'll win races. Don't worry. So the good year 23. Ah, it's an old Pontiac Firebird logo. It's cool. All right, so continuing on, trying to pick up another badge. Let's see what we can unlock today. We've gotten two badges today, the Focus badge and the Firebird badge, which is nice. Fortunately, no debut there, gold or victory. Okay, Let's see our best bet, instant badge is iconic. There it is, the new Firebird badge. Pretty cool. Um, more than one Fair Lady, not into that really. More than one Evo, don't think so. More than one Charger, that's possible. More than one Golf, that's also possible. I think I'm gonna try to get an M5. All right, I think we already have one M5, honestly, but. Car. Whoops. Uh, BMW M5. Is that already suggested to me? Yeah, that was an M3. So I'm pretty sure we've already got one M5 in the garage. Thinking about being an Audi collector. Let's wait. There's the Bentley DLC. Um. So that's DLC, DLC. There's the M5 right there. I'm pretty sure we got the other one. That's the M3 they suggested. There's an M5 too. That's it. We'll get this M5 for 32,000, or this M5 for 98,000. Guess we gotta get them both, right? We'll get this one first and put this one in the garage. Let's see what it looks like. Hmm. Not very inspiring. Yeah, wow. Not very inspiring at all. We're gonna just go ahead and get colors. Uh let's see. Then we'll have to deck them out. These are the manufacturer colors, huh? I feel like a red one. Alright, we'll go ahead and buy him. And then we'll come back and get another M5 to get the badge unlocked. This is your 2012 BMW. Looks cool. M5. We'll put some we'll put some uh, decals on you and whatnot before we send you out to the road. Alright. And let's buy the other badge. And there it is. Three two thousand. Now let's see. Hopefully they have some nice designs. Ooh, yeah. I'll take the fifty one. Fifty one. Good. Yeah, yeah, eh, yeah. eh. Uh huh. Maybe we can go with that 51. Yeah, that 51's cool. That Exxon 51. The Black 51. Oh, new badge and title unlocked. M5 collector has been unlocked. 
<laughs> That's three badges today this on a Forza your badge Saturday. BMW That's fun. M5. Cool. Let's give you a run. Actually, you look good. The Exxon 51. I like it. The Black 51. Uh, class competition? Nah, sport league. What sport are you? You are an executive sport. Oh, look out. You're in there with the Wraith, right? The Charcoal 20. And the other M5. So, executive vehicle. How much? How much? How much? How much? 33,000? It's not too bad, I guess. It's worth a badge. So, we're able to unlock that P class Ferrari. Um, Red Reese 12. And he's unbelievable. Heading off the road, Atlanta. Um, the Red Reese 12 is just fun. Check him out. He's from uh, Ferrari Friday. He was the first race, the headliner on the, um, or actually the, I guess the opening act, right? Um, on uh, yesterday's Ferrari Friday. So check him out. The Red Reese 12, just racing, beautiful debut race for that car. Brand new purchase. We'll probably have a an episode dedicated just to him soon, I would hope, because he deserves to get it. Chase event! We got a special event here at Road Atlanta. Race th your rivals to the finish through the traffic field circuit. Let's do it. Um, yeah, it's 1.77 miles. It's two laps. Let's take a look at the starting grid. It's the Professor, Nasty Tack, and Kit Kat Pingu. They're all in Audis, and I'm in a BMW. This is going to be fun. All right. Come on, Exxon 51, Black 51, let's do it. Rem oh, okay. Remember. One, two, three is gold. We want it. Or oh, actually, it's one, two, three. Gold. I don't think that's correct. One is gold. So, I think we're going to be starting right here in third bronze. Yeah, absolutely. One is gold, two is silver. We don't need bronze, so we need silver. Now we got it, now we need gold. Okay, let's catch him. Only two laps, so you gotta be smart. It's only 1.77 miles, man. Nice little over. Well, actually, a nice little U, I guess you'd call it. There's a professor. You know, seriously, three Audis against a BMW. I don't know. I don't know. But I don't think that's gonna happen. I don't think it's gonna be good for the Audi. Then again, Professor, Professor will be so if, if he has the car, there's a really good chance of getting taken. But in a chase event, you know, you gotta be aggressive like that and take it. Bang you! What was that, a Scion? Sorry, just cracked you. This is a really cool layout of the course here. Chevrolet Hill, like really quick as you get that inside. When you when you go full, you always see this one barricaded. Okay. Pretty good. One more lap. Ah. Okay. There's the Exxon on the hood. There's the street view. And there's the full view. Let's get it. The Black 51. Or the Exxon. This is just regular Road Atlanta pool right now. And then, right there. Right here. They barricaded it and they let you go inside. And it's a real cool section there. You cut that whole loop off. You come back down the long stretch that leads to the giant S. And uh, it's a it's a wrap, y'all. It's a wrap. Heading up Chevrolet Hill, we're going back inside the vehicle. It's M5 debut gold, y'all. M5 debut gold. Let's see it. Let's see it. Bangers. Yokohama Advan, Yokohama Advan, Yokohama Advan gold. BMW. To add to the goals that we have for BMW. I don't 
don't think it's new badge unlocked for that, no. But we got M5 collector. Very, very cool. And a nice run there for victory. And another step closer in that sport league to a uh, divisional series gold. So great job. Two races remaining only, so who knows who will race those in the future. Could be anyone. Could be no one. I wonder what the next one is, anyway. To Wisconsin for another event at ah, historic Road America, Road America where the fun. layout has remained Should unaltered for more than 50 years. Elkhart Lake, Michigan. Whoops. Elkhart Lake, Wisconsin. Right. I'm not from the Great Lakes region regardless, so it makes no difference to me. Kind of like Milwaukee. So there you see Road America, definitely a beautiful and fun track to drive on. Like that Sargento, jeez. So, heading back to the car house to try to unlock one more badge here, maybe two more. 46 minutes into the Twitch TV broadcast, we might be able to lock two more badges today on Forza Badge Saturday. More Dravatar rewards available. And let's see. What badge can we get? Go back to our iconic. And there's our new badge. We got M3s and we got M5s. Good job. Uh, let's see. Miata? Huh. Go for double Mazda. RX, more than one RX. That's actually the best. So, we're gonna get some, wow, drive 100 miles at Le Mans. Wow, 500 miles at uh, Indianapolis. Jeez, that's I've already done that, so I don't understand why that's not going to be mm, I think we're gonna go ahead and go for Miata or RX. Let's see what we can get. Get as many badges as we can. Let's go ahead and try to buy. Go to Mazda. I know we already have one Miata. We have an RX too, but I'm not 100%. Heading off to Mazda. Which means we should go to Laguna Seca, right? Okay, here comes the Mazdas. So, RX3, can't buy it either way. Can't buy that one either. So I guess forget the RXs. There's the Mazda Miata MX. Go with our, oh, there's an RX right there. Hmm, there's an RX8. So we could unlock the RX badge right there. And it looks like that's what we're gonna do. Huh. All right, so we had the RX-7. Now we're getting the RX-8. Let's see what we got here. This would unlock a badge for us. I'm almost positive. Oh, wow, Pac-Man. I'm liking Pac-Man. I think that's what it's going to be. Uh, the Golden 5 isn't bad. It's going to take a ways for me not to get that Pac-Man. Let's see. The Red 15. Ah, the Golden... Chinese fan, uh, fan. kind of like that as well. But Pac-Man 44 is just too cool, I'm sorry. Pac-Man it is! Look at that car! My gosh, it's covered in logos. Pac-Man and the Ghostly Adventures for 31,000. Bang. Buy it. Bang! New badge and title unlocked. RX Collector has been unlocked. Are you kidding me? Running out of uh, credits here, so <laughs> this is your I don't think we can go too much further Mazda today. RX8 R3. That's four good badges already today. Bandai N Namco. All right, let's check out what league you belong to. You are a compact, and you are a 
Oh, modern support, huh? Okay. The modern support compact. You're in there with the Patronus. Yeah, the Patronus 19, which is an amazingly good car. The uh, the 1M. And you're in there with the the Dunlop Carlson 24, the A45, which is also an amazing car. So there aren't. Oh boy, how much? Oh man, getting me down to bone zero, y'all. This will probably be the last before. Um, who knows what we'll do on Sunday? We got so many new cars now. Um, well, it's already divisional gold, so we're gonna head off to we head the Silverstone Grand Prix, Grand Prix, known as the home of British motor racing, with our Pac-Man RX8. And this should be fun. Of course, we love. It's probably Ratchet favorite course, right? Is this your favorite track, Randy? Yep. Love Silverstone. Usually for the chase event. Usually for banging many minis. Right? It's 1130 AM. A crisp 58 degrees. And I'm from the Gulf Coast, so that's crisp. All right, so... Um, 3.19 miles, two laps. Let's check it out. Terra Toy Tiger 31 has got the pole in a Mazda RX-8 just like us. A couple of Mazdas out there. Some MX-5 and, uh, and us. So, who came back? Oh my gosh. It's all mustard in a VW Golf. Nitu in an Audi RS3. The Sage 504, welcome back into Genesis 13. Alan Holier 22 in an Audi RS3, just like Nitu. And here's Johnny 8 in a Toyota GT86. I think we got a good chance. I don't know though. I mean, obviously, this is a debut vehicle, but I think I think the Mazda has a shot. Remember. What did the golfers So the Pac-Man 44 is going to get out there and do his thing. Mazda RX-8. With more decals than you can count. Looking good, though. Look at that center console. That's also really ingenious looking. It's not Sage. It's Alan Holier and his Audi. The engine sounds pretty good. You know Mazda Racing. Mazda engines. Pretty good on the... Uh, Racing horizon. Perfect turn, wow. Mm, Pac-Man's looking good so far. He holds the road nicely. Oh, Pirelli, get out of there. That's always my key. How do you corner? Right? How do you handle the track? really what I want to see the most. Here comes Medical Center. And Brooklands! Oh, there's Hulk. Hulk is always in these races. I'd like to see the VW Hulk. But we don't like to let the VW Hulk win! Curious Crane and goodbye, Hulk. We got a new line later. They're coming for me, but they got the catch pack man. They got some poles. Boom, 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 boom. Heading by race center. Race control. And we're opening up. I know some of my friends will join us, but right now the RX-8 is really good on the track. It says probably the last race of the day for a Forza Saturday. A Forza badge Saturday. I think mission accomplished. We got quite a few badges unlocked. Tune in and watch us again tomorrow as we try to take on, I don't know what. It's always up. Ooh, just got bumped. Oh, just got pushed as well. Who are you? Nitu, Nitu! Okay, you take the lead. I'll draft you. Remember, we got one more lap to go, Nitu. No one's quite close enough to make a difference. Don't be surprised if you get bumped, buddy.
like this Mazda. It's driving well. The engine is a little pop gunish, but it's nice. Got good acceleration and it handles extremely well. Thing here through the Mini S. Well done into the club turn up Silverstone. Catch a little advantage here on the corner. Did. Oh, it's right. Silverstone! Nitu, Nitu in his uh, Audi RS. Well, I'll tell you what, he's hanging. Get some new perspective here. Bang. There's our hood. Get on him. Review and height, full view and full, full view. Let's get it. Let's get it. We got to catch Nitsu. Heading down the Wellington Strait. Nobody's near us. It's just us two. Me and Nitsu. I gotta get some giraffe. Brooklands. How you doing, fellas and gals? Take me in an Audi. That's okay. Debut gold. Debut victory would have been nice, but debut gold is real. Give up yet. He might, he might get spin. You never know. Nitu's holding on in that Audi. There's no one near us in third place, which is amazing. Considering the deal that we got here. Oh boy. Oh boy. You just took that one really nice. Come on, monster. Come on, Mazda. Come on, Pac-Man 44. You still got a chance here. Guy, he's good on the straight, though. Really good on the straight. Pac-Man, the ghostly adventures. With a ghost of a chance here at Silverstone to win the Grand Prix. Nitu is not giving up, though. Nitu is not giving up at all. Oh well. Maybe? Only if he bumps and spins out. That's the only way I don't think he will be good of a racer. Okay. Not a problem. Heading back in the vehicle for a debut goal for the Pac Man 44. Here at Silverstone, nobody near. RX Gold! For Mazda. We couldn't yell Victory Mazda, but we could definitely say RX Gold. So good job there in your debut race. Look good. Could be fun. Don't know if we'll see you again on the track, but it's good to see you today on a Saturday. And new affinity level. Oh, man. That was close. That was really close. We're down to next to nothing though. But we'll recap the badges that we got today. All right. Let's continue. I think we've already got divisional gold, so there's nothing really to accomplish there. For the Mazda RX-8. So we'll head back to the car house, check out the profile. Yeah, divisional gold's already been achieved. So, good job. Pac-Man 44. As you can see, we have now 21,000 credits in the house. Uh, they would like us to get an MX-5 Miata. Uh, maybe someday. I don't know. Maybe someday. But we got the badges that we wanted. Let's check out and review the badges that we achieved today. Most of them on... All of them, I do believe, on Iconic Infinity. We were able to unlock more than one Focus, the Focus badge. More than one Firebird, the Firebird badge. More than one M5, the M5 badge. More than one 
RX mod. The RX mod. Right. And uh, I think that's the only badge we got today. So, until next time, we tried to get this badge right here. We actually ran the race and won it with a 1977. Well, we didn't win it, but we got a gold with a 77 Firebird Trans Am. And uh, badge still locked. So, I don't know what to do there. Um, yeah. Okay, so, until next time, and all we do, we give glory to you and race for him and always win. Great job by the Pac-Man 44. And we'll see you again soon as you see our total stats there. All right. Always racing, y'all. Almost every single day. So check us back on a Forza Sunday for the next episode of Forza Motorsport 5. And until next time, we wish you a... Let's check out his badges. Let's check out the badges. Oh boy, you want to check them all out? All right, let's check out all the badges. Player status. Or status. Okay, next. Achievements. Mm. Wow, a lot of achievements. Next. Affinity A to H. We should already have Ferrari. I don't know what happened. We got Ford. But we should also have Ferrari. I to O. There's a Mercedes. P to Z. Nothing. We unlocked a lot of iconic affinity today. Leading track. Career badges. 500 gold medals in career. Multiplayer. I, I got two. I don't do that often. Community. Not bad. Boy, a lot to unlock in community. And regions. All the flags that are represented in this game. My flag? Oh, my favorite badge is... Triple crown. That's my favorite one. I see. If you're going to race, you might as well go for a triple crown, right? So, until next time, we wish you a... Good night and happy for Sebastian. Good night. See you again soon. Have a great one. Drive home safely.